87% of young Americans say they do not believe that they are at risk for an HIV infection. There is one thing in life you can count on. There are no guarantees. Man, you got to keep moving forward. No matter what you got, baby, life's still gorgeous. You got to move into the future. No matter what you don't have, life's still beautiful. You got to keep moving forward. No matter what you got, baby, life's still gorgeous. You got to move into the future. No matter what you don't have, life's still beautiful. I don't have much, but I still have a lot. You have everything, but not what I got. And I'm not trying to trade. I choose to lay in this bed that I've made. I'm trying to be brave, baby. Look at my face. It's the face of a winner. Championship contender. Just let me make it through the winter. Spring or make summer better than any I remember. And I remember them all. Fell down many summers to get up by fall. Life is a game. I guess you have to play ball. Either that or forfeit. But that you can forget. Push into the door splits and you storm the fortress. But if you have God, you never play by yourself. Just ask for forgiveness when you're asking for help. For real. You gotta keep moving forward. No matter what you got, baby, life's still gorgeous. You gotta move into the future. No matter what you don't have, life's still beautiful. You gotta keep moving forward. No matter what you got, baby, life's still gorgeous. You gotta move into the future. No matter what you don't have, life's still beautiful. You gotta keep moving forward, no matter what you got, baby, life's still gorgeous. You gotta move into the future, no matter what you don't have, life's still beautiful. I need your attention, please. Thank you. This is Brianna, the young lady that will talk to you about HIV. She got HIV? Yes, I have HIV. Yeah. And I would like to share my story with you. We come this morning to share what this family is doing this hour of bereavement, to share with them the loss that have occurred within the midst of their family, the loss of a son, the loss of a brother, the loss of a friend. And there's a message in this loss that Christ is sending to us that we need to be examine ourselves and take a look at the decisions and the choices that we make and then make sure that with anything that we do, that we put him as the head and let him guide and lead us. So therefore, we make the right choices and the right decisions. And our life be good if we accept him and let him guide us. Let's look at 1 Samuel, the 20th chapter, in the 18th verse. Then Jonathan said to David, Tomorrow is the new moon, and thou shalt be missed, because thy seat will be empty. May the Lord have blessed the reading of the word. This time we have a song. I've had some good days I've had some hills to climb I've had some weary days and some lonely nights but when And I think things over all of my good days outweigh my bad days. So I I won't complain. Hey, Brianna. Uh, guess who has a question? Who? Oh.
Wow, girl. You're so beautiful. I mean, dang. I'll give you anything in this whole world. I swear. So I'm trying to make you my girl, my love, my life, my everything. So, uh, you want to be my girl, right? Brianna. 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 Are you hey, Danielle. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Mm. <laughs> well, you know, it's uh, Derek who has a crush on you, right? What? Who told you that? Girl, I have my sources. So, uh, let me introduce y'all. I don't want to go over there. Girl, yes, you do. Come no, on. I don't. Girl, come on. Right, we gotta do it big, dog. Oh, man. Hey, everybody. Um, I said, hey, everybody. This is Brianna. Hi. What's her name again? Her name is Brianna. Okay, okay. So there, yeah. I'm having a party this weekend. Parents out of town. Got the crib to myself. It's gonna be off the chain. So I know you coming, right? I don't know, maybe. If y'all ready for some more poetry, let me hear y'all make some noise! That's what I'm talking about. Now y'all know every Thursday we do Spoken Word Cafe, right? So what I need y'all to do is I need y'all to put y'all hands together, show some love, respect the mic, and give this sister a warm round of applause because it's her first time coming to the stage. Y'all make some noise for Jasmine! The title of this piece is called Nubian Teens. By the blood of kings who've died for your lives and the love of queens who've nurtured your lives, my Nubian teens, you have the genes to become whatever it is you dream. The world is watching and waits on you, for they've heard the power in you. Your strength is amazing. Your intellect worth praising. You're surely kings and queens in the making. You provide an element of hope for our kind and the ability to unify the differences of mankind. You are the living dream that Dr. King had foreseen. You are tomorrow's heroes, today's hopes, and yesterday's dreams. You are Nubian teens by virtue of your being. You are truly our everything. Fear not the world and the problems around us. Fall not into hands of villains who surround us. Hold fast to love, peace, and goodwill, for it will lead you to where dreams are fulfilled. Nubian teens, for that's what you are. Graceful and resilient you are by far. Nubian teens, on you we call, take pride in self, lest tomorrow you fall. The world is in your hands for you to mold it. Remember, it takes time, so with patience, you will own it. And that's that piece. Come on, Brianna. You, uh, you going to Andre's party? Um, I wasn't invited. Well, you are now. I mean, you gonna roll with me, right? I guess. All right, cool. I'll see you there. I think he went in the kitchen. Girl, I'll be right back, okay? Okay. This is how we get down. Hey, bring us a couple drinks back, all right? All right. Man, so I'm glad to see you finally came. Oh, really? Yeah, come on, let's dance. Hey, we came to party. Hey, we came to party. Get up off the wall and go shoot something for me. Hey, yeah, we moving like that. I did see you up in the party. Tell the DJ play the track. Hey, we came to party. Hey, we came to party. Get up off the wall.
Polly gon' shoot with a shawty. Hey, yeah, we moving like that. I did see him on the track. Tell the DJ run it back. I am looking at shorty. Shorty dancing on the floor. Hey, let's go someplace quiet. We can talk. Sure. All right, wait here a minute. Shorty, she. Hey, Femo, I need some place quiet, dog. You need some place quiet. Yeah, you know how it is. Hey, you can use my room in the back. Right, that's what's up, that's what's up. Hey, but hold on, though, I got you. I'm not pretty Ricky, but she crying on me. We cross slide, we down the way. We pop it out, not gonna work, not gonna work. Hey. DC up in the building, we getting crunk, tell the roof up on the ceiling. We came to party, and we came to party. Get up off the wall and go. Hey, did you hear about Kelly? Kelly, that church girl? Yep. What about her? She died yesterday of AIDS. Hey, Kelly died of AIDS? Girl, stop playing, not Kelly. That's what I said. I thought she didn't get around like that. Yeah. Wait, but Derek, she used to mess with Derek. But wait, he was her first. Oh my God, Derek gave it to her? I don't know. I wonder who gave it to who. And who else did they give it to? Mm -hmm. What am I looking at? We heard you got HIV. We want to know if it's true. True. Oh, you hear that? It's all over the school, the internet, everywhere. Everybody saying you got AIDS to Kelly. What? I ain't got no HIV, dude. So how you know? You been tested yet? Back up, dude. I don't even want what you got. I always use a con, so you can't get no. Don't nobody want to hear all that, dude. Just leave. My joint, man. You see this dude? Man, I can't get down with you, cuz. You burn. Alright, there you go. So leave. Oh, so you ain't heard me. Talk to you for a moment. What is it, Brianna? I'm running late for class tonight. Ma, please. I really need to talk to you. Honey, is everything all right? I don't know how to tell you this, but I had sex with this boy. No, you didn't, Brianna. How many times have we talked about sex and how these boys will promise you anything? And you promised know, me. Ma. You promised. I know. You. I was stupid. I was caught up. I don't know what happened. Look, honey, having a baby ain't the end of the world. We can. Come here. You and the sweethearts gonna be okay. You hear me? We're gonna get through this. Together, you hear me? Derek. How could you do this to me? I'm sorry, I don't know. How could you not have known? 
There was no way for me to tell. I wasn't sick or anything. And I never thought to take a test until now. I'm sorry. Whatever, Derek. I can't believe how stupid I was. Mama said to lay down with dogs and get up with fleas. I guess Mama was right. This is hard on me too. If I could change things, I would. Well, it's too late for that now. I hope you tell everybody that you sleep with and everybody that you go sleep with that you're infected. You destroyed a lot of people's lives. Derek committed suicide before graduation. He spiraled into a deep depression and lost the will to fight for what life he could have had. Live your life and be strong. You must carry on. Asking questions with no answers because you feel that it's wrong. Reminiscing over specs while I write this very song. Reminiscing over Derek while I write this very song. Yesterday I saw this brother. Tomorrow I, I won't see this brother, brother no, no more. Have you questioning God asking why did he have to go and none of us know We just have to deal with the sorrow and I know you feel it deep And I know at night you weep which makes it hard to sleep and the climb out is steep But I know that you can make it God wouldn't put you through it if you couldn't take it you just have to live your life This morning we come to share with this family during the hour of bereavement The hour of loss but Truly it is a great loss and in that loss there's a message for all of us. There's a message about the decisions and the choices that we make. I've buried far too many and it's never easy to handle it. Feeling a sense of abandonment. Like what did all the prayers, incense, and candles get? But you can't question God, even though the road is hard. It's the road put in front of you and you gotta walk it out. That's why you have friends and family so you can talk it out. So you can review it all and try to figure out what it's about. And if you can't understand it, maybe it's not for you to understand All you can do is remember that man And do what you can do to finish his plan And live your life for all that it's worth And recognize the blessing of your birth And thank God for every step that you take on this earth Cause tomorrow isn't guaranteed to be honest The rest of the day is a promise Do what you can now So if you die tomorrow, your last day on this earth wasn't living in vain We'll all have to pass on and leave our friends and family with the pain Just have to live your life you gonna be okay? I'm gonna keep working on it. I'm proud of you. You know that, don't you? I never got to tell him that I forgave him. It's not your fault. I know. But it gets really hard sometimes having this disease. And I must really count on Look, Brianna. I don't just drop my friends when they come up on hard times. I'm someone you can always count on. And you can believe that. I believe you. And I have to stay friends forever. Forever, girl. Teenagers like us are the new faces of HIV. People I've known have died. So it's become important for me to share my story with you. Having sex may be fun but the few moments of pleasure may turn into pregnancy or even HIV and AIDS. Before I go, I can answer a few more questions. Yes? You said that the person you got it from died. So why is it that some die and some don't? HIV reacts differently in different people. Some people have stronger immune systems than others. That's why some people die faster than others. Yes? Can you get HIV when using a condom? Yes, there are possibilities. Yes. Did the person that gave it to you give it to anybody else? No one had the courage to come for after he died. That's why the disease spread so fast, because no one would tell anybody. Yes. Do you think you will live for a long time? I hope so. I'm just going to listen to my doctor and my mother and do the best I can. Any more questions? Well, that's it. And remember, Abstinence is the only way to stay HIV negative and AIDS free. No, the subject, the subject is more than just something that needs a mention, you know. I mean, it's something that it requires everybody's full attention. It's not going to get better unless we start dealing with prevention. Back in the days before we could get AIDS from a virus that fatally infects. 
just how free it could be. We enjoyed recreational sex. That was back when sex and safety got mentioned by nobody in the same breath. Now there's such fear, safe sex, that's all we hear. Love got laid in the shadow of death. HIV. Study the facts about who is. 